Hello and welcome to the support video for Workload Automation video series. In this video, I will demonstrate how to change the statistics retention period on Control-M server. Normally, when you view a Control-M job statistics on the Workload Automation GUI client, you will see a default of 20 entries of successful runs. In order to change the statistics retention period, there are two parameters on the Control-M server that controls this. Run inf purge mode, run inf purge limit. If run inf purge mode is set to zero, then the last 20 executions of each job are saved. If run inf purge mode is set to one, then Control M will only keep statistics for the last x days where the default for x is two days. If run inf purge limit is set to 25, it will keep 25 days worth of job statistics. Another point to note is that on the Enterprise Manager side, there is a system parameter called Run Info Max Samples that will determine how many entries are shown in the statistics screen on the GUI client. Please ensure to update this EM parameter as well. The conditions for statistics to be collected are that you need to run the utility CTMJSA on the Control M server. Also, check that statistics mode is set to either job name or mem name in the CTM menu. And in the Control M Configuration Manager, check that EM statistics are also matched with either job name or mem name. Check that run info max samples EM parameter is also set to the desired value. I will show you a demonstration of these values on a version 9.20 Control M environment. This is a Control M job that runs daily to collect statistics using the CTM JSA utility. By default, there are 20 entries of successful runs as you can see here in the GUI statistics screen. Next, on the Control M server, run CTM underscore menu, then select option 4 for parameter customization, then select option 2 for advanced communication, and check that statistics modes is set to job name. Next, in the CCM, we select the Control M server, right click, and select properties. You can see that EM statistics are set to job name as well. Also check that the EM system parameter run info max samples is set to the desired value. We right click on the EM component and select system parameter and look for the run info max samples. It's currently set to the default of 20. Now that all the necessary conditions are in place for statistics collection, we will look at how to increase the retention period to 25. To increase this value, go to Control M server machine and navigate to ctm underscore server slash data. Then edit the config.dat file. Add the two lines to the bottom of the file. And save the file. Verify that the entries are there with the cat config.dat. Then restart the control M server via the CTM menu. Option 1, then option 8. Then check that the Control M server is not running. Then option 4 to start Control M server.
After that, we go to the Control M Configuration Manager to also update the EM system parameter run info max samples to match the value of 25. Save the value and then recycle the gateway for changes to take effect. Right click on the gateway component and select recycle. After that, perform a rerun of the Control M job and you will see that statistics entries will increase by 1 until it reaches 25. Let's check the statistics of the job and you will see that the statistics have increased to more than 20 entries. That concludes this Control M Solutions video. Please see our knowledge base and YouTube channel for more videos like this. Thank you for watching.